And we're back, and now it's time to share with you my healthy lifestyle tip of the week. Now, many of you know that when you're in a training program and you've been doing it for quite some time, you are gonna hit what's called a plateau. In other words, you don't see changes because most likely what you're doing is you're repeating the same thing over and over again. Our bodies adapt to it, and once they adapt to it, there's no changes. So what can you do to make some changes? Well, here's four things you can do. First of all, change the equipment or include the equipment. By just changing the equipment or including the equipment in an exercise, now you're getting other muscles involved and that gets your body more adapt to changes. For example, if you're doing a sit-up, include a medicine ball with it and hold it straight right in front of you. That way when you come enough for the sit-up, you're not only working your core, but you're working your arms and you're working your back as well. So that's one thing. Number two, the one thing you want to do is uh, take the, the training outdoors. You want to take it outdoors. Why do you want to take it outdoors? Because this makes things interesting. You know, and also the popular things that you hear about, the boot camps and the fitness events together. Why are they so popular? Because they're outdoors and they get people together and energized. The second thing, the third thing you want to do is intensity. You want to increase the intensity in your training. In other words, if you're running on a treadmill at a consistent pace, that's after a while, your body adapts to it and then you see no changes. But if you modify the velocity or the elevation on it, now your body has to work harder. And once it works harder, now you're burning more calories and you make the change. And the last thing you wanna do, which is very one of my favorites, is to uh, make sure that you um, uh, change your partners. Now, if you have the ability to make a workout with a different partner, that can make a big difference. Because when you're training with the same partner, they're always bringing the same rhythm, the same energy. But when you're changing somebody else and you bring somebody else into the picture, now you get the complete picture. You get different ideas, different modalities and techniques, and that could change your routine very easily. So those are your four things you can do to make your workout a little more different and a little more effective. And that's it. And thanks again to all of my guests for being here today. And thanks to all of you at home for watching. Make sure you tune in next time for another great show. And remember, take care of your body today, and it will take care of your tomorrow. See you next time.